Hey, all my fashionistas, fashionistas out there. It's your plus size fashionista. Mm hmm Yep. And this is going to be a review from Milani Cosmetics. So, if you guys want to stick around and stay tuned for what I have from Milani Cosmetics, please stay tuned and keep it locked to me. Okay, okay. I'm back on my fashies, divas, and dolls. And like I said in the intro before, this is a review from Milani Cosmetics. So, you guys know that I love Milani Cosmetics. I rent and rave about their items. Yes, I've been sponsored in the past by them. And yes, this is a sponsor review again. But... Besides of me being sponsored or not, I always go and purchase Milani items, whether it is their cosmetics or nail polish or whatever the case may be. So, without further ado, let's get to the video. Um, everything came in this box. I mean, everything was bubble wrapped really good. Nothing was broken, which I absolutely love. Um, I've used everything that I've gotten, and I've gotten one, two, three, four, five items. So I'm gonna start, I use everything. So I'm gonna start off with this first item. Um, Cause this is the main focal point on your face, is your brows. And this is from Milani. And this is the brow tint pen. And it's in dark brown. And I want to keep all the original packaging to show you guys. And basically what this is, it's a brow pen and it's long wearing and it dries quickly. And basically, it has a fine tip to it. It kind of mimics like a marker. If that guys give you a visual, if that gives you guys a visual, I'm sorry, guys. And I'll swatch that. You can see that right there. And I did, I did use this on my brows. Which I will do an updated, updated video on how I do my eyebrows. Because now I do a different technique. So every time I do, you know, a different technique, I, I always try to update and do new videos. Because, you know, I do have quite a few um, brow tutorials on my channel. But like I said, you know, I do change what I do or whatever. I do the same thing. But, you know, I might do a different element into it. So I like to, you know, update it, you know. Because I always get questions on my brows. So I like to, you know, keep, you know, fresh videos up. But anywho, enough of me rambling, you guys. How I do it, I basically um, put um, eyeshadow primer on my eye. And then I go off of using, I use this. And I use it, you know, I trace, kind of trace my natural eye, eyebrow shape. And I use this lightly. Because this is kind of like a stain to me. And then I use my powder to go over it. And then, you know, I use my concealer or whatever. And I will do, you know, a video. Basically, what I just said is how I do my eyebrows now. But I will do that video coming soon. So, stick around and stay tuned for that. And I absolutely love this item. And matter of fact, I went to Walgreens yesterday. And I seen all of these items I'm going to show you except for this. Maybe I wasn't looking good enough. But, yeah. And I'm not sure how much it costs, but you guys know that I will put in the fashion box, you know, all of the prices. And I believe I'll put the direct link of each item in case you do not have um, a retailer that carries Milani. You guys can go on Milani.com, MilaniCosmetics.com, I'm sorry, and um, you can purchase there. Okay. We're going to go on to this. You guys, you know I always talk about this. I love this. And this is the Even Touch Powder Foundation. And it's oil-free and it's 06 Caramel. And I don't want to buy you guys. And I love this because you can just use not even a lot of this. And it will make your face look so flawless and airbrush looking to me and again i'm gonna have to use that um saying my sis baby take the 23 use it's not you know the the item doesn't matter you know how much it costs it's how you put it on it's how you you know apply it so i do want to shout out my sis baby take a 23 hi sister so yeah i i love this and i love it so much that when they contacted me to do another review, I had to get a new one. So, I have not used this. But I have purchased this. If you guys seen my haul a while back 
that CVS was, you know, doing a, a sale on, you know, trying to get rid of some of their items. And I caught this one on sale. And as you guys can see, it is hitting pan. But I'm the type of person I will not open anything else until I use this. So I will use this to the very last drop. Then I will use this. But you guys, I love this. Please do not sleep on Milani Cosmetics. I mean, yes, they're reasonable. They're drugstore cosmetic. But <laughs> you get... I mean, they should charge way more than they do for their items. I can't stress that enough. I know I keep saying that in every review, but I honestly mean that, you guys. I do. Because the quality is just impeccable for the price, long-lasting. I mean, pigmented. I mean, everything. Okay. Um, I got the Secret Cover Concealer Cream. And this is one of their new items, I believe. And this is in Deep Tan. And this is the color. And I'll swatch it. I know it kind of looks a little bit darker than my skin tone. But once you, you know, work it in, it melts, it matches. And this is a concealer. And how I've been using it, I've been using it, like, to conceal my eyebrows as well as I've been using it, you know, as, you know, a foundation, if you will. And you guys, when I tell you, this... I can't compare it to anything else because I have not, you know, got the, you know, the MAC concealer and all of that. But this little doodad is, I can't even explain, but it is really good. I, I mean, I really can't say anything bad about any of these products because i honestly been using them every day. And I've been having these probably about a week or so. So, you guys already know I'm not going to say nothing bad about Milani because I love Milani anyway. And it says it's oil-free, fragrance-free, waterproof, and long wear. And that's good because there's a lot of people out there, a lot of divas that, you know, have allergies and skin is sensitive. So, that is good. It doesn't have any fragrance. And I can tell you, I'm the type of diva I wear my makeup from sun up to sundown. So, this lasts. Okay, this right here, it is their baked blush. And this is in Coralina. And I will show you guys the color. You probably can't see it. But it's a coral color. And it uh, is sparkly. Now the only thing that I don't like. is extremely sparkly. I did not know this when I picked it. Or else I really wouldn't. It wouldn't have. Um, because I do love corals. And I know this like corally, pinky, mauve blushes compliments my skin tone because I have um warm undertones so I know this you know colors like that I just mentioned compliments my skin tone but I don't like <laughs> I don't like the sparkliness of it now only thing I can tell you is if you do get this blush don't apply so much of it on because it'll have like that sun-kissed kind of look and feel to it but again if you apply too much of it you will look like a sparkly mess i did that and i look like fairy godmother from cinderella or something i looked at a mess so i will say when you use this this one coralina please use a tiny bit i mean a tiny bit and i will swatch it for you guys so you can see it hope you guys can see it's right it's right there it's a pretty color, don't get me wrong, but it's just too much sparkliness. I'm not down with a lot of sparkliness. I do a little bit of shimmers, like when I do my bronzing on my face to do the sun kiss look, but I don't like all that sparkliness. And last but not least is the Milani Bronzer XL All Over Glow. And this you can use this all over. You can use it on your body, your face, it does not matter. And this one right here is Bronze Glow. And one side is darker. The other side is lighter. And I've used both sides, but I mainly use the darker side because I use that as a contour. And I have it on right now. You brought, you guys probably can't see it because it's like nighttime now. But, yeah, I, I used it. <laughs> and I love it. And it does have a fragrance to it. It smells really, really good. It smells kind of like a perfume or something. And I like that. So I was sent five items from Milani, you guys. I love everything. Except that one little kind I had of their blush. 
But other than that, I do like everything. So again, please check Milani Cosmetics out. I will have their link so you guys can check out, you know, their site. They're always updating, always coming out with new new cosmetics for us to try and as well as i have the list of all the items that i just showed you previously in this review and the prices and all of that so i want you to do one thing for me stay fly stay fashionable for less also tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel so until next time honey nistas take care bye honey nistas and before i get out of here i'm gonna get questions on this hair and on my lips my lips I have on from When Wild Don't Blink Pink. And I have on um Wet and no, not Wet Wilds. Um Love and Beauty, um lip gloss and velvet vanilla. And um my hair is coming up in a video soon. I don't want this video too long, but it is a fusion unit that I custom made. So if you guys want all the specifics, I will post the video link to that video so you guys can check that out it's gonna be like a mini review of it so yeah you guys bye honey nieces